everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to show you how to dry dark crochet hair or any dark hair for that matter we're talking the one the twos the fours so i'm going to show you the product that i'm using and i'm going to slow this down for you guys so i'm using the color shot ink the upholstery spray and the fabric spray now the upholstery spray i am trying out the purple spray is the one I usually use, and that is for fabric. Now, of course, this is not typical hair dye. Just keep that in mind. You want to spot test it. Make sure that you're not allergic to it. This is my first time using the interior spray. Um, I'm trying it out. I really like that dark blue color. These are my colors. So I've been playing around with hair dyeing for quite some time. And this is the best method I've come up with thus far for darker hair. I tend to buy hair on sale. And that means when you're buying it on sale, you're usually getting the last of the last. I only paid, I think, a dollar for the hair that I'm spraying here from Sam's Beauty. And, of course, they didn't have a color that I would like. So this is why I came up with a method as of such. So you're going to go ahead and you're going to spray um one coating first you're going to give it about the bottle says five minutes to dry but i find it takes about two minutes to dry you're going to fluff out the hair especially with this one where the hair is so compact and then you're going to go ahead and give it another coat now the good thing with this product is i tend to only do two to three coats but you can keep going as long as you're letting it dry in between coats, you can keep going. So here I am showing you the difference between the dark blue and that brown that I had before. Because you might not say, well, that blue looks so dark, I can barely see it. Well, that's kind of what I was going for. But um, you have to flip the hair around because remember, this is kind of like an outer coating. Now you might say, oh, why don't I just use, you know, like those hairsprays you see in the beauty supply store? I don't know if you guys have used those before. They get everywhere. I used to use them on my natural hair a lot. And they used to get all over my car's interior <laughs> and everything. And it's just very messy. This method, for the most part, I find does not shed as much. And I also would only recommend this on here that you don't mind being on the crunchier side. I find it dries kind of crunchy. Once you flip the hair over, you want to do two to three coats. I also want to ask you guys to please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching this video. I'm going to show you guys a before and after of the hair right after this. I would not recommend washing out this product immediately after putting it on the hair. It needs 72 hours to completely get in there. I have tested this product in the pool and at the lake, and it held up really well for around four weeks and i'll touch a picture of that as well thank you for watching my video again 